Hey guys, and welcome back to Legends of Idol On, and we are back in World 4 with Pet here, and you can see I'm up to Wales again. I've been going through and filling out my foraging with Wales, and then I have snakes in between uh, with some snowflakes and such like that. Uh, doing some house cleaning here. I've been pretty bad about uh, cleaning these up, but I have to uh, trash some of these to get materials for upgrading. Uh, we're up to the walking stick in World 1, but honestly, probably not going to mess with that too much for right now. Although I may want the Nutto or the uh, Poopas uh, at some point, so for battling. Uh, we're going to focus on these diamond meals here. We've got two of them so far. So, probably going to switch over to salad. You can see on that part, I'm at 251k cooking speed. Almost 200k on the second one. And then, I have mostly been saving uh, that one spice, the blue spice, just to use for alchemy. So, we'll be doing some of that. I think I have that one at, like, level 12 or something. Um, but still, I don't really have enough of those, so I've having, been having to use the bargain tags a lot on those. Like three or three or four bargain tags per level to make sure I can uh, maximize my gains on that. Still getting good levels here on my Maestro. Level 71 Worship. That's a huge gain over where my Worship was. I mean, I felt like I'd barely made it to like 50, and then all of a sudden it just started going way up. As you can see... Uh, over level 15 everything but catching at this point so the whole uh, crystal countdown combined with candies from the Easter event really made a big difference uh, level 157 on the maestro so that's going pretty well as well from uh, the crystal farming very quick leveling level 54 fishing it's really enabled me to get fishing done a lot faster because I thought fishing was kind of hopeless. But that one's actually moving a lot better. So let's get this void net uh, done up here with upgrade stones. And uh, then we should be in pretty good shape with at least void tools in every slot, I think. And then from there, probably next upgrade is going to be luster uh, hatchet. And that's the only other one I think I can do for the moment. I do have materials for the Luster uh, pickaxe, but I need four more mining levels. So it's probably going to take, well, I don't know how long it's going to take because there's multiple days in each video here. So uh, let's get these stones on uh, Slim Sharp Fin. Finally got the uh, materials for that. So we're going to start putting these uh, green weapons on all of my characters. So they can maximize their damage output. I have a lot more upgrade stones now. Finally starting to get a better stockpile of those. Helps to buy them like as often as possible. Uh, but the post office also helps a lot with getting upgrade stones. I did not realize that at first. But I have a bunch of uh, silver pens. So I've been utilizing those to get upgrade stones when needed. Alright, so... Pretty good shape here. As you can see, uh, 12 mil damage with no pain, no gain on. And it can go up further if I try to make it go up further. Um, this isn't like full damage necessarily because uh, I could switch my cards around. And as you'll see in a minute here, I'm going to uh, put some things on in the lab. If I put chips on, I can get it up like another... 2.5 mil uh, to almost 15 mil damage with uh, chips on and there's probably some other things I could do as well for example the Easter backpack would give another 10% um, the trophy I have on is for money so not necessarily my max damage but uh, as you can see it's very the damage is very dependent on exactly what gear I'm running and exactly what uh, chips and cards I'm running so 
Uh, here we go with the Luster Logger for my wizard, which is sort of my pure woodcutting character. So we have that set up, and that's going to help out with uh, some of my 3D printing, hopefully. So 602k cooking speed, making some good progress in this video. Good progress on that front. So uh, upgrade the salad there. Going to try and keep getting more uh, platinum blue colored uh, plates here to increase our cooking speed even further. And that's what we did. So uh, let's take a look here. Diamond Chef as well. I've been working on that one. Only level 12. We got more work to do on that. But it's hard to get enough spices for it. So I really have to use like three or four uh, bargain tags every single time. So, uh, level 158. And uh, we're going to get some more worship XP here. 71 up to 72. Level 72 worship. So, here are the stats we have at the moment. 49 catching. Almost have that one up to 50. So, we still got some more work to do here. Every other level over 50. 61 trapping. Uh, 72 worship. 63 alchemy, 31 breeding, 32, um, not sure what that one was called anymore, 32 lab skill, so research, so we got uh, the void weapons, I mean the void tools and the luster tool, so that's the situation we're at right now, and the next one up is going to be to build the luster logger for the maestro since we already built it for the wizard and then after that we'll do the pickaxe once i get the correct levels so here it is uh just put in the luster logger on the maestro level 159 hopefully this will help with our wood cutting xp So, looking pretty good here. Let's see what else we got. So, we got the fourth diamond plate there. Now, let's check on the cooking speed. 787k, 815k per hour. As you can see, it's starting to really speed up a lot more quickly. It kind of starts going exponentially faster, the cooking speed, as you move along. And especially with the alchemy bubble plus the diamond plates. Here's the uh, situation in the lab. I've been getting more gems. I've been actually putting, I've been putting more money in this month it is the truth of it. So I've been buying the jewels that were in the shop. I've been buying the chips that were in the shop. Uh, and I've also been buying some eggs that were in the shop, although not every day because it gets a little expensive. But I'm trying to put more money in to the game uh, since we still have a, a lot of people watching Idle On right now. So I want to make sure that I'm, you know, doing what I can to keep things interesting. So we have a pretty good stack, uh, a pretty good chain here down the lab. The only part I'm really missing is the animal farm part at the beginning. And then I'm not getting the, uh, the uh, alchemy liquid speed. Not so sure about that to begin with. Uh, but so yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. So leave a like if you guys enjoyed Let me know what you thought about the video in the comments what you think about maestro progress thus far I think it's going pretty well and I will see you guys in the next video